Welcome to the Allianz Arena in Munich. And our live game is Bayern Munich against Manchester. This is Peter Drury and I'm happy to inform you that Jim Beglin has joined me to offer his expertise. Thanks for that, Peter, and may I say a big hello to everyone. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? David Silva, the little wizard, as clever and quick-minded as they come, seems to glide across the pitch with very little effort, and a player at the very top of his creative trade, always, always good to watch. Yes, they'll certainly be leaning heavily on him. Still going, where to next? Well played, he saw that coming. It's loose, who's getting there? Thiago gathers from the goal kick. Thiago conjuring up some magic on the right-hand side. Still goalless at the moment. Kolarov, Mogala, Fernandinho, and Vidal! To be fair, that was tough for the keeper to handle. Silva. So what now? Lewandowski. Thiago. Zabaleta. Fernandinho. Yaya Toure. Now the pass. And he's there to cut it out. Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. It's almost criminal to see a defence fail to identify someone who thrives when it comes to shooting stats. They knew, and yet they didn't heed, and they've paid the price and deserved it. Having a player with such ability in your side, he's always capable of coming up with something important, and he's done it again. And out to safety. Bayern Munich is still behind as we reach out for half time. Robin passes it through, and it's the goalkeepers to claim. Silva. 
moves it forward. Fernandinho tries a long pass towards the front. Jerome Boateng knocks it towards the front. And he's through on goal. Throws it out of harm's way. And that'll be the last act of the first half. Well, they definitely won't be happy with that half. They seem to lack a bit of desire, especially going forward. It wouldn't surprise me to see a change or two. goes and we start the second half well I'm sure the managers talk the talk and now it's time for these players to walk the walk and deliver a rousing response to a rousing team talk fished it away oh bang on target Gets it away. Aguero. Alaba with the ball through. That's offside. Yes, it is. Gala. Bayern Munich still chasing a one goal deficit here. That's surely a foul free kick. Fernandinho. Silva. Fernandinho. Look, should they not get back into this game, the possession stats will hold the reason why. Everything is a bit rushed, frantic. They need someone to impose a more composed approach and just settle it down. Looks like a good ball through. Cut out in the nick of time. Zabaleta. Both sides a bit lacking in intent. It's a throw in. Manchester looked all at sea and terribly vulnerable, but they've got away with it. Bayern Munich haven't yet dipped into their subs. Jerome Boateng comes sliding in. It's Lewandowski. Lewandowski. Out to the left it goes. Roman! Oh, just needed a better contact. Yeah, they have lots of options in the box there. They've got plenty to chew on at the moment, but no bite. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the effort he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Botamendi. Yaya Toure. Fernandinho. Thrust towards the front line. Tries a through ball. has crossed the line and it's a throw well for me this was the obvious substitution he'd become just a little jaded and as a result of that he was most likely to make a mistake I think sometimes when the body becomes tired the brain goes with it and I think that's happened in this case and it's Fernandinho Fernandinho has got himself a free kick oh that's a booking always looked it forward I think they need to be more direct now and just start getting the ball forward Sterling looks to slip it through Clichy that 
intervention was very necessary. Robin, it's a long forward pass. Ribery. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? And there goes the final whistle. One goal settled it. A tense and exciting game that just got away. Do you know, after the goal, I thought they had time on their side to get back into this match, but that stubborn opposition defence, they always looked that little bit too strong. That's where we have to end it from me, Peter Drury, and my co-commentator, Jim Beglin. A very good evening to you all.